How's it going, hey, guys? Good, man. How are you? Good. I'm great. I'm happy to be talking to you guys today. Oh, yes. We're so happy to be talking to you. Yeah, absolutely, guys. It is a pleasure. Um, the first thing I want to say, first of all, love the movie. I think it's fantastic. I loved you guys in it. You know, I feel like a lot of Jackass fans are probably a little hesitant at first having some new faces added to the crew, but you guys fit in perfectly. And I loved you in the movie. But my like first question for you guys would be when you were making the movie, like when was that first moment where you felt totally comfortable with the crew? Was it after the first shot, the first time you met them after the whole movie was done? Like when was it for you guys? I'm gonna go first, uh, Zach. Floor is yours, buddy. Um, yeah, I think it was just uh, I think it was after like my first couple of stunts. I was like, okay, now they know that uh, that I'm I'm not gonna like say no to things, and I'm just gonna right. You know, I'm, I'm gonna do gnarly really shit with them, you know. Yeah, love it. Yeah. <laughs> um, I would say after the treadmill stunt that we filmed, because it was pretty gnarly. Like love everybody it. was legit hurt afterwards because it was pretty fast. And then Steve came over and he like gave me like a his blessings like of like you're a gnarly right. dude and I was like cool cool now they they know I'm crazy too <laughs> right you like you earned your stripes on that one <laughs> yeah yeah for sure and that, like, that one. <laughs> yeah <laughs> and I know you guys were fans of the show obviously growing up so you were inspired by a lot of the things that they did stunt wise so I'm curious like was there a specific specific stunt that you saw growing up they're like oh, okay I want to do that I want to follow in those footsteps that's the one <laughs> that inspired you I'm curious. Um, you want to go first, Jasper? I couldn't. There's nothing I saw that I said, "Ooh, I want to do that to myself," because it's a lot of painful <laughs> stuff. Yeah. <laughs> but for yeah. sure, like just the whole vibe of just hanging out with your friends, just having a right. good time, is for sure there. And I feel like that's like something that anybody would want. Right. I, I mean, it felt like it kind of felt like a high school reunion almost, like where they were all yeah. getting together again. There were some new faces around, but like, I felt like the chemistry between all you guys was great. Yeah, like they yeah. were they were the seniors and we just we were the freshmen. We just came into it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. When I was younger watching Jackass, I guess it was it was definitely sort of more like, yeah, like I really I want to have fun with my friends just like this, you know. And that's mm -hmm. what like ignited like me, like the spark in me to like want to do like stunt stuff like my whole life pretty much. <laughs> That's awesome. And I know like a lot of these stunts, they're obviously dangerous and there's a lot of work that goes into them. And I'm curious because I know you guys were probably nervous to do some of these stunts. I mean, some of them are daunting just to even talk about. So mm -hmm. my question is, is like, was there any stunt where maybe like one of the original guys kind of came up to you, gave a little extra boost of encouragement, a little bit of support where it kind of put you over the top where like, you know, I can do this. Hmm. I don't know. I feel like everybody was supporting everybody no matter what stunt it was. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And uh, I'm always nervous before a stunt, no matter what it is, because you never know what might happen. <laughs> or even if it's even right. a real stunt, it might be a prank at the end of the day. So that's another thing on top of it. But uh, no, it was support going around for everybody. And nobody made me feel weird or anything. It was all mm -hmm. it was all hugs and kisses. <laughs> <laughs> that's great. <laughs> how about uh, how, how about you? Um... Zach um yeah um yeah it was always everyone's always really supportive you know of everything um I never really felt like there was um anything like uh yeah I mean they were always just really supportive of everything you're about to do there wasn't really anything that was like so da like super dangerous where I was like oh uh, like I, I need like I need support right now before I do this <laughs> <Right>. I <don't> <laughs> but I mean you know everyone was always I mean everyone was always just there for you you know and just like stoked for you like you're you got this you know you got this even mm -hmm. though like they maybe thought like you didn't have it that way. like you know, <laughs> yeah. like, he probably doesn't right. have this but he, he's probably gonna get hurt but it'll it's gonna be good footage you know like yeah. that kind of thing. i mean you totally get that vibe like you guys are almost like this tight-knit family even just from the get-go i mean i feel like any fears that fans had you know about new faces coming in were just like assuaged immediately because you guys all felt like you'd been doing it for years so and yeah. one thing i definitely want to know is like those guys they've done four movies now you know, they've done stunt after stunt after stunt. They're getting up there in age, obviously. Um, my question is, is like after doing just one of these movies, are you more stunned that they've come back to do, you know, like all these sequels? Or do you completely understand now because it's so much fun? Um, I would say both. It's so yeah. much fun, but it's also can be very painful and scary. Mm -hmm. I remember I, I, one week I couldn't really move my neck fully to the right. <laughs> 
<laughs> right. Bro, yeah. I, I'm, I can move it now, so it's all That's good. good. Progress I, has been I made. I give it to them. They're, they're brave <laughs> soldiers to even come back at the age they are and be doing this wildness. Right. Gotcha. How about you, yeah. Zach? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's definitely, like, such a fun, like, uh, if they said we're making another movie, like, we're going to start tomorrow and making another movie, I would do it in instant, you know? Um, yeah. but even though I am, like, younger and stuff, but, like, the thing is, like, it, it does take a huge fucking toll on you. And I do understand like where I do see it like that being, that's insane thing that they made for these movies, you know, um, especially, you know, yeah, definitely, definitely that's, that part's insane because like it took a huge toll on me. I know there, there was weeks and different times where I was like, dude, this fucking hurts. This sucks right now, but this is really <laughs> right. fun. I'm having like the best time of my life. So it's like worth it, you know? Gotcha. And like, uh, like, I'm all like, I'm also really uh, curious is that, you know, after, you know, making all these, you know, these movies and like after having four of these now, do you feel like each of these movies is like a different animal? Like where like, I remember there was an interview with Steve-O where he said, you know, Jackass number two in particular felt like they were really going for broke and how this one, I think from a lot of interviews seems like, no, it was just great to get the gang back together. And it was just a blast, you know, it was like picking up where we left off. Do you feel like this one is really different in comparison to the other ones? Um, I never looked at it like that. That's yeah. a good question. Uh, like, that's like, the first, it was like the first one, I feel like is like an extension of the show. You know, right. the second one's just like, I think like the gnarliest one. Mm -hmm. The third one's just really, the third one's really good. I don't really know exactly how to compare, you know, and like a lot of it was 3D, right. you know, and then this one was like the gangs back together and there's some new people too and, and they can hang, you know, like, and that, that's what I feel like, you know, so. Yeah. yeah, I'm gonna backpack off what Zach said because I have no <laughs> myself. Fair yeah, enough. Word up. <laughs> and but mainly it's like the oh, yeah. but mainly like you were saying though, it's like the the gang's back together, and that's like the yeah. that's the fun thing about this movie, you know. Yeah, and I have to say, I feel like when you're seeing those guys continue to do these crazy things, does it like inspire you more on set? Like when you're about to do a stunt, you're like, you know what, these guys are still going for broke. Let me like really go for it this time around. Oh, yeah, for sure. Looking at some of the stuff that like Steve or Aaron did, I'm like, all right, that's way wilder when I, than what I got to do. So I'm, right. I'm actually flying with feathers right now. I'm, I got to do this. <laughs> so I'm going to do this. I'm going to maybe hurt myself or not. But you know what? I'm going to get up and I'm going to yeah. walk away. <laughs> and you did. And you can move your neck wholeheartedly yeah. now. So, yes, Progress. all the way. <laughs> Sleeping was terrible that, that, that little week. <laughs> oh, I can only imagine. Oh, my God. <laughs> How about you, Zach? Did you feel similarly? Yeah, definitely felt the same. Um, especially, you know, after watching Aaron get destroyed this entire movie. Um, <laughs> I know, you know, it made me feel good knowing it's like, yeah, if Aaron can get this destroyed, I can I can do this stuff too, you know. <laughs> Absolutely. And like uh like definitely like the the last question I got for you guys is I'm definitely curious about this. Is like what's the most unexpected bit of wisdom you got from one of the guys, whether it was something maybe they did that really like registered with you or something that they maybe said on camera, off camera that really like resonated with you guys? Hmm. I think the wisest thing they ever told me was don't think about what you got to do. Just go in there and do it because you don't want to be have that in your mind. Yeah. Like, but they usually don't tell us what we got to do anyway, though. Right. But like yeah. sometimes you might hear about it and then you like, I wonder who's doing that. But just. Just keep an open mind. Don't overthink things because that's when you, you know, start, um, what's the word I'm looking for? You start being like more timid and that's how you get hurt because you're not putting mm -hmm. your all into something and you're kind of like right. half-assing it. So yeah, that, that was a thing. Like just fully go for it and what happens, happens. <laughs> nah, I love that. Love that so much. How about you, Zach? Yeah. Um, I think it's just like, don't, don't think, just do, you know, just do. Like, mm, don't get in your head. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, but I like guys, it's been a pleasure talking to you guys. Like I said, you guys were amazing in the movie. And I, as a Jackass fan, someone who grew up with those movies, love laughing at these things. Uh, I really hope to see you in some future installments because you guys really are talented and you bring a really interesting sense of humor to it that I really love. So thank you guys for thank taking you. the time. I really thank appreciate you. it, guys. Thank you.